Uh, yeah, it's been some things happening with Summit and Sea of Thieves. And holy shit, people are making videos out of it. Um, let's see what's up with that, because I have no idea. I always leave my reactions off, so we can see it by ourselves. But let's see, this one has like a lot of views, so let's, let's watch this one. How many times you have to hit the... I tweeted at Sea of Thieves today and told them that uh, you should do dailies and weeklies to get the fucking chests flowing on this game again because it's been really dry. I also have uh, people sharing their complaints <laughs> that uh, that they're disappointed in Rare for wanting to to get on and play with Summit. <laughs> what the fuck? These are the same guys, chat, that preach and moan about Wait, these what? guys on these really dry. I also have uh, people sharing their complaints <laughs> that uh, that they're disappointed in Rare for wanting to to get on and play with Summit. <laughs> what the fuck? These people? are the same guys, chat, oh, that I? preach and moan about these guys on these PvE servers aren't hurting you. So why do you care? Well, I mean, listen to what you just said. Me playing with the devs aren't going to be hurting you at all. So why? So, wait, 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 Sammy played with the devs? Or it was planned to play with the devs? Why the fuck do you care? Just listen to yourselves for two seconds. That's interesting. Because the last time that I, that I heard was Sammy, it wasn't... It was hated. In general, just hated for playing this game. Blows my mind. The hypocrisy coming out right now from some of these players. Oh, I love pirate games, but I'd like to sit in my server and not play pirate. What do you mean? True. True. The fucking pirate game. You are expecting PvP. Yeah, it's a pirate game. Pirating. It's, and it's you always, know. you know what's funny about this argument? It's always the guys, the guys who uh, complain about it, they're, they're always the, oh, I don't participate in these PvE servers. In fact, I frown upon them. But it doesn't make what Summit do, uh, Summit's doing right by going into these servers and messing with people that, uh, that, want, that don't want to be messed with. Wait, is he joining the PvE servers? Picking on the, on the people? I don't know how the greeting can be done on the PvE server of Sea of Thieves. I've been watching a little bit of Sea of Thieves. I, I understand and I know the game. But I don't know the difference between the PvE and the PvP. I guess PvP, they can kill you and sink your shears while on the PvE, they can just pick up your loot. I, I'm not sure I was happening. I just don't get it. I don't understand the mentality, chat. Somewhere in my brain, it just doesn't compute. You know. And if there is someone playing PvP, I get it. Sorry, uh, playing PvE server and not want to be messed around, just literally do PvE. Since we do ARC on the PvE server, we don't want to have people around, you know, dropping dinosaurs to our dinos, killing our dinos, griefing and all of that, because... We just want to enjoy and explore the game. After we learn the game, then comes the PvP just to add to the content, right? That's how it goes. Now, for Sea of Thieves, I'm not sure. And I understand the players having frustration if Samin was going to grief a PvE server. I get them. I've been there. I feel you. I don't know the circumstances over here. I don't know what's happening. You know what I mean? Hopefully we'll get some more information. Somewhere. I just don't get it. It doesn't make sense to me. You're not participating in these servers. Okay? The servers don't affect you. And me interrupting those servers doesn't affect you. So why am I like some big bad guy here? I don't get it. Alright. From what he's saying... And then some it's... guy makes a video... Alright, from, from what he's saying, it's he doesn't affect the players. He cannot grieve. He's not grieving. I don't... Just because he is on the server? 
Apparently, I haven't seen the video, but apparently of all my toxicity that I brought to the video game. And it, I'm sure that it's got to be biased because I'm, I'm absolutely sure he hasn't put any of the nice things I've done in this game right into this video. It's just all like the yeah, he did a lot. The, the moments where someone probably talked shit to me, Good then stuff. I talked shit back. Or maybe I was just feeling trolly that day, so I was trolling a little bit. It's crazy. Should I watch it on stream? Please? Let's, okay, I'm, I'm actually down. All right. I mean, I have to go find it, though. I, I don't know where it is. We're going to get some more insights. Let me see if I can find this. There thing. we go. Um, I got to look at my mentions. And it should worry uh, the, my chat as well. That's the reason why I'm, I'm reacting to this on the stream, because I want you guys to get involved into, in general, what's happening. You know, about toxicity on any game. And overall, I like to comment about, in general, games. You know, I, I just enjoy it. I, I love video games and I, I love any type of game, even though I might not play it, for for example. Um, let me see. It's like if you like sports, you like everything. You're down to watch a hockey game if you like football, you know. Even though you don't understand it. <laughs> I think that's a good comparison. That's a good explanation. But I want to know how Sammy is toxic. Let's see. Because I've been uh, watching his streams when he plays Sea of Thieves. It's pretty Yoshi? hilarious. Not toxic. I haven't seen toxicity coming out of him. I don't know. People are really... Uh, people are getting kind of weird about all this, to be honest, man. People are getting kind of weird. Interesting post. Here we go. Sea of Toxicity. Don't invite Summon 1G to the Sea of Thieves uh, developer stream. Okay. <laughs> Rare. If you're thinking about having Summon 1G on the stream, it's. I find it so funny that people don't have any more time on their hands, right? Like, you can't... Don't you have a job? This, like, making a video about... Hey, don't put Summit on the developer stream and so on and so on. That's toxic. Even though the... The person itself is not toxic. The practice, what you see over here, is toxic. It brings toxicity. Uh, the the video over there. Or something? You you can't it can't bug you this much that you feel like you have to make a fucking three minute video about it. No way. No way. What's up? Let me put some volume up. Please don't. Con please reconsider. Don't actively endorse someone who has a history, both recent and distant, of extreme toxic. Extreme. I think my toxicity kind of is like normal. I don't think I have extreme toxicity. Yeah. Pretty normal. We get it. We get it. We get it. We get it. You know what I mean? Uh, and so I think it's. A you know what I mean? Sometimes you just gotta grow a sack. You know what I mean? Uh, and so I think. I stand behind that. Opportunity to to go through that and remind everybody of, of what the Pirates code is of Sea of Thieves. Fuck it. Keep them alive. I want to slay these idiots now. Just fuck the Pirate code. Hey, so I stand behind that too. Sometimes to you sometimes you got to throw the Pirate code out the window. It doesn't mean I do it all the time. I realize I'm not going by Pirate code, but whatever. This was one day worth of clips, by the way. This was one day worth of clips where me and the guys were just feeling fucking trolly and having a good time crapping on people. People were talking shit to us. We were talking shit back. I mean, from the looks of it, it's a PvP because they can kill each other. So the, uh, he talks about the pirate code, by the way, which that means. I'm, try I'm trying to think about the pirate code. Go to the ship, steal their stuff, sell them goodbye. I guess that's the code, which breaking the code, that means. You steal the loot, you sunk the ship, and you still griefing them by still killing them. I'm gonna guess that's the pirate code. Hey, get fucked, Orangey. Everybody Orangey! I thought that was fun. How fucking long did you have to run for, huh? How many times you have to hit the wheel all the way left or all the way right, you fuck? Every time you hear a cannon shot, your, your fucking driver's like hard. I was frustrated. Left, hard right, and I'm pissed about it, you blunderbussing piece of shit. 
I think that's fine. Mother effer. You're going to do that to my boy like that? Give me that dust. Give me that fucking dust. <laughs> that's funny. That's toxic. But it has to be, has to be a reason behind. Maybe they, they've been trash talking or something. I don't know. Oh, that's fucking toxic. It's funny. We've been treating each other with. Oh. So your captain has sucked my fucking dick. And when adventuring out in the Sea of Thieves world, remember it's a shared world adventure game and everybody you encounter is another player on their own adventures. Well, you fucks, man. Oh, I'm so triggered. Jesus, man, how fucking long do you want to run for to save your goddamn chicken? <laughs> Jesus! I think this is a great video so far. You have an emotional connection? What the fuck is happening? <laughs> Thanks for your dust, bitch. And if you engage in combat with people, which is of course absolutely fine, whether it's sword play... That's my general reaction, it's funny. Combat, like, do so with respect for other players and treat those players with the, the kind of respect that you would expect to be treated with yourself. Fucking video game, dev. What do you expect people to be all cuddling? Give me a break. You idiot. You f I was gonna fucking leave your ship, you dumbass. Oh, God, dude. Can't help idiots. <laughs> okay, I beat a little mean there. That was mean. Code in sea of thieves. Call him. Fuck the pirate code. Uh, uh, um, you know, fight with honor out on the seas. And you're bad. Give me your fucking dust. <laughs> Just think about This it. was all one day. One day worth. It's not like this happens every day. Like the people that you're playing. So he ag uh, acknowledge, acknowledge, or acknowledge, whatever, that he's been toxic. It's just one day. Playing with the people that you're encountering and the experience that they're having. You, you, uh, you can't title him a toxic player if he does it once. It's like naming XQC non toxic or whatever. Like, being toxic every single fucking day or whatever. I don't watch him, I just watch every now and then some videos. And just make sure that you use voice in the right way and see if these. Hey, nice man, nice. Suck a fucking dick. <laughs> what you say Bring in a sword to a gunfight, huh? Uh, 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 uh. Give me that dust, motherfucker. Yeah, that wasn't even that bad. This was just a small collection of clips from only two days of his streams. Yeah, that's because all the other days are fine, man. The other, all the other days are like, they're not even that bad. Oh, dude, we can very easily chat. Okay, listen, this is one of those videos where we can very easily make like a heartfelt, someone is really wholesome kind of stream. When I let that kid kill me, when I'm trolling the kid and don't actually I've kill him, them. when I'm fucking, uh, when I, uh, when I went and did uh, Athena's with that one kid who only had $133 after playing for a week. We can make like a wholesome video too, just the same, of only one or two days of clips, man. I, what do you, I don't understand. I, why are we acting like that's extreme toxicity? You know, I'm not telling anyone's moms that I'm gonna, I'm not telling anyone that I'm effing their moms. Okay, one. Okay, I'm not. I think you did a couple of times, but all right, debatable. I'm not dropping any sort of racial slurs too okay True. i'm not True. making anybody feel awful about their lives you know what i mean i'm just talking some shit while i'm slaying dude that's complete normal levels of toxicity on any other video game after after a team runs from you for 20 minutes with nothing on their ship and nothing to lose i get a little triggered and when i'm finally slaying your ass i'm letting that trigger out a little bit i i don't understand the problem here Listen, guys, True. we can't all pretend we're Care Bears at every fucking step of the way. Stop acting like you haven't said anything bad in a video game and acting like we're the saints of the video game world. We all need to band together in this pirate game <laughs> and be a good-ass community. Give me a fucking break, bro. That's the guy's job. He's supposed to say these things on the YouTube, all right? Not all of us are sitting there being good fucking sports about every little thing that happens in life, especially on a video games of pirates, man. I, come on. Give me a break. It is true. It is just a fucking game. Play it and you'll see how toxic people can be. Um, as I said, I've been watching a couple of videos every now and then. Uh, oh boy, it's, it's terrible. I'm not gonna lie, the toxicity that's coming out, being like, oh, he's fucking hacking, he's hacking. There's been a lot of hacking activities happening. Most of them, if not, the majority of them actually do hack, but the, the toxicity that's coming out from, from 
the players is it is true i've seen it i've, I've watched the youtubes grab your fucking sack yes i'm saying it jesus man jesus this is nothing compared to what i actually saw on uh, on rust myself yeah yes look at this dude the, you know why i'm disappointed right now that i'm sitting here and nobody has sunk me yet that's why i'm disappointed that no one has walked by, saw a sloop sitting here, and took the opportunity to shit down its throat. That's why I'm sad right now. He's making content pretty much because there's nothing to do in the game other than chasing fucking chests, you know? He's creating content Trust for his me, viewers. Trust me, I love PvE players. I need you guys. You guys need us too. It's time to start admitting it, all right? I'm sorry that I talk a little shit while I'm dunking on people. That's just how I roll. It's not going to hurt anyone. That's true, like, you are a pve -er, being over there, then you have, like, someone, you know, that likes to do p PvP, he jumps into you, he starts slaying you, speaking trash to you, it creates content for both, it's part of the game. You know, it's not something that you, oh, you open up the game and you see someone in front of you fucking killing you non-stop for hours, no, it's, you know, it's part of the game, I, and... To clarify that, I don't think there is a PvE only server. Uh, it's just players are more PvE, tend to avoid fights and just go. It's part of the game. You're going to get attacked. That's what you're playing. It's a PvP game. And that was, it's not even like every time. Sometimes, most of the time, I do it in silence. Okay? Most of the time, I'm just so sad that you don't even have any freaking chests that I sink you and I leave without saying crap. That was just a day where I was triggered beyond belief because of the things that were happening. So I decided to take a day right through the pirate code out the window and crapped on people. And you did well. That's content. And I, yeah, do that shit. Uh, to let's free out, it's better to be toxic and yell than destroying your stuff. Sometimes you want to go all 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 in, you know. You want to go and, and entertain your people, and not only that, have fun. It's part of it's part of it. Not intentionally griefing every single day and being fucking toxic, but every now and then having a little bit of fun is doesn't hurt anyone. Boo-hoo, you lost your ship and zero chess. Or you're gonna spawn it again and continue with your journey. That's, that's about it, you know? If it's a permanent, like, if you are playing Ark and some idiot drops a wild dino in your dino pen and kills all your dinos, yeah, that's permanent. Happens. You, Yeah, that's toxic. But if you go uh, sink... A ship that doesn't have anything and spawn it a minute later. What's the big deal? And that's just how it went. Correct me if I'm wrong, but yeah, that's how I feel. And listen, man, it doesn't hurt me at all if the devs took your side and one day said, you know what, Summit? It's probably not a good PR move to play with you because you got a lot of people that hate your guts. It doesn't matter to me. That's fine. Saying the developers playing with you, you mean actually the developers playing with Summit? They can make their own decisions. They're adults, man. Why are we acting like it's going to affect you? Hmm. That's we're not, we're, there's, it's not some publicity move where all of a sudden me and Sea of Thieves are going to start banking in money and start making some killing on this game because we decided to come together and play a few rounds of Sea of Thieves. All right? There's there's nothing behind it, but hey, we saw you're playing our game. You know, Maybe you can jump on with devs, you know? Yeah, that sounds cool. Chill out with us. Maybe it's a fucking boring game, to be honest. So if you don't create your own entertainment every time that you find entertainment go for it i've seen plenty of streamers man playing this game and it's it's all the same they're, they're just flying around sorry flying shipping around boating around not nothing really interesting happening while you're like yeah give me entertainment right it's, it's boring why should i smash my keyboard when it's my fault that i died or i'm not that good as enemy is
as he said, not all of us are good sports. Yeah, saying that is like, go with it, right? It happens to me when I was playing Ark, right? Uh, I got, I considered it grift, you know? We were trying to set up a PvP. Uh, the guys came over to do the to build up a fob so they can they can attack their base, and we said, "All right, it's gonna happen like an hour from now. We're gonna get ready. Uh, you get ready, and in one hour clock, you're gonna we're gonna start." They joined the stream. They've been watching my stream, and they've been killing me as I was farming. That's I consider like griefing. I, I it, it got into into me. I wasn't a good sports on that part because we said it's going to be in one hour and you go build up a fob and you enable it outside my base. And not only that, you jump from your dino intentionally killing me an hour prior to the PvP event that we set up to do. And I got triggered. Yeah. That is a different story though on having something organized and someone griefing you, not allowing you to farm resources and whatever, and and finding someone in the middle of nowhere going, killing him, spawning his ship back, and voila, bye-bye. That, that, that's okay. Me losing my gear while I'm trying to gear up for the PvP event, that's a dick move. And I couldn't go with it. It was toxic for me. Uh, then it's good to have like 10 minutes stream delay. But yeah, imagine me and you communicating every 10 minutes. It's not, for, it's not convenient. And that's one of the reasons why I don't do PvP. Because people, they know where I am at, at any time. I leave my house, they snipe me and so on and so on. Uh, I, I generally don't enjoy PvP games, and if I do, I would probably play them off the stream. On the stream, man, it's fucking, it's fucking weird. Unless I go and hide my, my servers, and I go undercover with, without anyone, without letting anyone know what is my server, and, and so on. Which we did, but it's, it's pretty hard to, to hide it, and... I don't know. People find out where where you live and whatever you play. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I'm most likely going to play PvE with no delay. I like the interaction. And if it's a good PvE with a good content, then I love it. Hey. Oi. Bye. Anyways, let's continue with the video. I want to see some more. Maybe we can shoot you some, uh, maybe we can give you, uh, some insight as to what's happening in the next game, dude, and show your, uh, and show the viewers what's going on, you know? Maybe they want to get the word out there and maybe give a little bit of fucking hints and, uh, and secrets to a lot of viewers at one time. So they want to hit me up. And maybe we'll fucking PvE the whole goddamn time. I don't care. You can do whatever they want to. I'm on the, it's on their terms. If you guys want to see PvE and 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 nice talking to people and when we're done killing somebody, yo, good game guys. We hope to see you on the seas again. We had a really great experience stealing your shit. Um till next time. If you want that, that's fine. Yeah. All right, that's interesting. That's the first one that we saw. Interesting, very interesting. I I, I said my opinion about it. I said what I what I wanted to say. That's the that's the video over here. That's the guy who's sn snacky. Yeah, go watch it on your own time and create your own uh, opinion. I guess. But let me know what you think. I wanna I wanna continue with the next one, which is Sammy's react to Myth Twitch Prime ads. Now I didn't know about this one because I know that 
Ninja did it. Uh, Anat. Let's see what is this about. Samir reacts to me. Twitch Prime Mat and cringe. Do not Prime sub after this video. If you plan on Prime subbing after this video, at least wait. So I don't feel like I just debated you. Please. Oh, you may be asking, what's Twitch Prime? Well, let me tell you. When you connect your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch account, you can get one free sub to any streamer on Twitch. I can't do it. I can't make it through it. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> I can't do it. I tried. I gave him my best shot. I give you my best shot. You genuinely understand that the, the majority of their viewers are fucking kids. What's going on? Just reacting to some videos. That's it. Nothing special. Nothing Nothing too interesting. Summit 1G reacts to Don. Invite Summit 1G to the Sea of Thieves. Developer streamer is supposed to hate. Is that the same one but a longer one? I tweeted at Sea of Thieves today and told them that uh, you should do da dailies and weeklies to get the fucking chess flowing on this game again. Yeah, we've seen this It's been really dry. Wait, 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 wait. Let's see if there is more after the previous Listen, one. Listen, guys. We can't all pretend we're Care Bears at every fucking step of the way. Stop That was just a day where I was triggered beyond belief because of the things that were happening. Was it like 13 minutes video or something? I think it's just all of these. Bully people off of their ships, okay? They bribe people off their ships. Wait, wait, wait. I want to get to the moment where... I'm not sure if it's somewhere over here. Those effects. I wish I, I, I wish I watched this one before the other one. In the problem here. It's not an exploit at all, Lipton. I'm calling you out now because you decided to speak up about it, all right? It's not an exploit at all. Wait, 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 wait. So it does affect me so that I make sure they feel those effects. And, and, and nice talking to people. There we and go. when we're done killing somebody. It's over here. Um, till next time. If you want that, that's fine. That's a continuation of the previous one. Off the shop needs something for the launch. Off to the shop needs something for the... Lunch. Then finish my house in Ark, then expand that house. Oh, you're talking about stuff. Gotcha. Point is, stop being a hypocrite, okay? If you're gonna say these PvE servers aren't affecting me, then me... Wait, there is PV service. How does PVE service affect in Summit? The fact that, that more people, they prefer PVE and the PVP servers are not that active? Question mark? Maybe that's the way that he gets the effect. Me going into them doesn't affect you. Also, likewise for me playing with devs. It doesn't affect anybody, man. Don't that, be a hypocrite about that, it. You feel me? That it doesn't. Yeah, you playing with the devs I'm doesn't telling you anyone. the PvE servers affect me emotionally. Okay? I have nightmares. Okay? All night long about people boosting their accounts and then me having to work hard for it. Alright, dude? So it does affect me. So that I make sure they feel those effects. Unless... Um, wait, isn't a, a lock where PvE... Characters that stay PvE, PvP, characters that stay PvP, no. They can transfer. Right. If they can exploit into their PvE servers and it doesn't affect you, then I can also exploit into those same servers, which also doesn't affect you. I'm not seeing the problem here. Not sure about the exploit. If, if that's what they... It's not an exploit at all. Lipton, I'm calling you out now because you decided to...
if he's talking about players playing on the PvE, leveling up and jumping to PvP, all set. Yeah, that's an exploit. That shouldn't happen. PvP stay with the PvP. Uh, PvE stay with the PvE because there's a dif difference on difficulty and and all of that. This is PvP. You have people killing you. It's PvE. You have no one killing you. You are free to level up and grind your shit out. Speak up about it, all right? It's not an exploit at all. Okay, I'll tell you what, man. Do you have any idea what they do to get full ships on these servers? Do you think they all just jump into a server? And like, they're just like, hey, man. Oh, dude, I know you. I know you. Let's just align the whole thing. Do you think they organically go across the seas, seeing if people want to fucking uh, team up and, uh, and start? I would have no problem with that. No, what they do do is they bully people off of their ships. Okay, they bribe people off their ships. They send the, they rotate these ships all damn day to people who only want to do PVE servers with nothing else. It is absolutely exploiting. Lipton, please explain to me how you get onto a ship with multiple people when the game only intends you to play with four, max. How do you queue in with all your buddies on Discord? That's interesting. Lipton, I know you don't have an answer right now, bro, but it's called exploiting. Starts with an E. Spawning with multiple people on the same boat? Ends with a G. I knew it was a four co-op players, no more than that. So they are exploiting in order to get more people on the ships. That's dumb. There's letters in between. Lipton, I need I need an answer here, brother. Tell me, what do you think it is? Do you think that's what the devs had intended? So when they don't have an intention for the double gun and it gets changed, no complaints, huh? Grab the chat. X. <laughs> what? Egg, egg, egg. For once, I feel alright about the fact that my chat is now spamming X. And I see it on another streamer. I feel uh, it feels good. And it's unrelated to the meme at this point. We created our own meme from Ark, eating a wyvern and egg by mistake, a high level, as an accident, getting bullied for it for like the past week or so. And then the meme appears on Instagram where an egg gets the more uh, the most upvotes or retweets or it's not a Twitter Instagram likes I don't fucking know then then everyone I don't know it's just the coincidence having the chat spamming egg 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 on my chat and then that happened and now I see eggs all over the place if it's good He replied. I didn't see what he said. Tell me what he said. Help me out here. We have some ligma as well. I'm, I'm just trying to read the, his chat. He says, you go around and convince people to join the alliance. And when they get off, tell them to uh, let you get on their boat. No, that's not how it works. Clearly, you don't do a whole lot of it. Alliances what happens is they take over a ship, they put the fucking guy in the brig, and they wait till his dumbass leaves so that they can get the ship. That's what happens, my brother. Okay? When I used to play Yark Age, I understood what he said. He said, waiting for a player to go away from his ship and then literally driving the, the ship away. Uh, when I was playing Archage, it was a, a button that you press, which that was a mark. So the person that was on the wheel, uh, he pressed the, the button. Uh, the ship gets marked to the player and no one can, uh, can ride the boat at all. And they have they had like a cooldown of like three minutes or whatever. So it could be easily be placed to to this game as well. Arcage being an MMO pirate game. 
over here another party game it could be easily could be easily do that not allow the players the the other players the the random people to grab your ship and just drive away that's that's what kid up even though you can technically i think spawn to your ship still isn't snuff that's stupid You need to intentionally kill yourself so you can spawn to your boat. And tell me what I do to get onto one of these servers. I do exactly the same thing that they're doing, but I don't fucking bully somebody off their ship. I have somebody who happens to be uh, a spy on their shit, and he gives me the ship willingly. Not a big deal. Doing it the exact same way. I've seen him doing that. I'm sailing off to the fucking thing. In fact, I do with less toxicity than they do it. So what's the problem here? I think it's a I think it's a cool pirate thing to do. While they think they're doing a cool alliance thing, I think I'm doing a cool pirate thing. They get together on Discord to get these servers created so that they can have an enjoyable experience with their buddies. I get into these servers using the same means to as fuck them, them up because I want to kill people and take their stuff and that's where all the stuff is it's not my fault you have this tiny tiny population of uh, pirate legends who all want to go into their little safe spaces to do Athena's okay you guys do that I want into these safe spaces you want this skull like how many times do I have to talk about this this cannot be that hard to understand. If you, you can do it, we can do it. It's full circle here, PvE and PvP. If one side can do it, the other can too. I don't give a shit if you guys think we're hurting feelings. It's a pirate game. Your feelings aren't gonna be okay when you get your shit stolen. You're not gonna feel good. Yep. That's what happens. You know what you signed up for. That's the whole point. Hey, thank you everybody who subbed to the channel. Welcome to the Squad, guys. Hey, nice to see you again, Big Sub Sub. Hey, what's up, dude? How you doing, Chills? Good to see you, brother. Exploiting starts with an E, ends with a 1G, dude. Hey. There been some frames on the stream for some fucking reason. Is my character even still alive? I'm gonna leave the video over there. Uh, well, yeah. You got, you got the idea. You got the idea of the drama and all of, and all of this bullshit happening. Um, I, I don't know. I don't have anything else to add into it. It's just players are stupid. They know what they signed up for. They play a fucking stupid uh, pirate game. Well, that's that's the content for you. That's that's pretty much what it is. Okay, I cannot. I generally cannot add anything into it. It's just the whole drama with the summit and and him playing with the developers and all of that is just. Dumb people just overreacting over nothing. That's that's where I, I'm gonna leave it.